forgive me! Shit! Watch your linear entertainment. Go watch porn. Just go away. Shit. Fuck you! What the fuck? Disrespectful little asshole. I can't believe you did that. That's my TV. You don't talk to me like that. I can't believe you. Mom was right about you. You don't know any better and you can't help it, but you're an asshole. Yeah, well, why don't you do something then? Besides just stand there. Why don't you hit me? Is that what you want? To be hit by your son? Yeah. No. I just... I want you to do something besides sit there eating. Yeah, great. Thanks for the fucking guidance, Dad. It means a lot. Wait. I'm just trying to help you. Yeah, well, nothing says I love you like smashing my fucking TV. Nothing at all. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just wish we could do things together. Yeah, what things? I don't know. Uh, go for walks. Play ball. You know I have bad glands. Yeah. Bike ride, then. Bike ride? You want to go on a fucking bike ride? Fine, fine, let's go on a fucking bike ride. <sighs> Fuck me. We'll take a bike ride along Vespucci Beach, and I'll show you just what you want to see. This day was going so well until you showed up. You know that? Ugh! Yeah, well, you're lucky to even be allowed out of the house after that boat stunt. What's the big deal? If anything goes wrong, you can just big shit. I'm going gray listening to this crap. Station change. Fuck yeah, I'm a jam. How am I meant to develop my own moral sensibilities when yours are so unbelievably fuck-faced? Don't push me. Seriously, some guys borrow your bow. Borrow? You were hiding in the head crying kidnap. They just took receipt of your property with payment pending. If it was anything other than what you told me, then that's on you. All right, they fucking stole it. And who knows what they would have done if they found me, but I didn't expect or want them to get killed. You think I'm gonna let some guys ride off with my son? Look, I knew you were a bad guy, but... Oh, a bad guy. A crook, a killer, a thief, a liar. I guess I've been all those things one time or another, right? It's just... What? I always thought I was the good guy. God help the morally bankrupt planet your generation have left us if you're the good guy. Yeah. Anyway, I always knew you were the kind of person who didn't let other people get in the way, but I hadn't, like, seen that happen before. Yeah, well, that's me, Jim. And I've been trying my best to get things under control for the last 10 years. But that was an extreme fucking situation. Here we are, the bike rental place. Please don't well, shoot the bike no. rental guy out of, like, What's force of habit. Later? 
Hey, you! Two bites. Take your pick. I'll take this one. Motherfucker! If I beat you to the end of the pier, you're buying me a new TV! Into the pier? All right. But if I beat you, you're gonna behave like a human being. Give it up, no man. Way. You've gone to sea. Yeah. In this oh, kind of condition, sorry. a triathlon would kill you. Uh, My body isn't meant to work like this, but I'm making it to beat oh, you. Shit. If you bike a few more miles, hey, we might be able to squeeze you into some skinny jeans. Hey there, Karen. If I have a heart attack, it's your fault. Hey, don't they have fitness video games you can play now? Hey, remember me, it's Mama. I'd never bike with the man who murked my flat screen. What am I gonna do with all that spare TV money? <laughs> That's true. This hurts so, so much, but I don't care. Let's go in the water. It's Come not on. the winning. <sighs> <sighs> Looks like you're buying your own TV. <sighs> you know, this is real nice, Dad. Bonding, good times. Yeah, yeah, I'm giving it my best shot. Come on, we're having fun, right? You wouldn't know fun if it sat on your face. Ah, come on. I mean, why do I have to hold your hand through this whole midlife crisis bullshit? And why don't you stick your nose up Tracy's butt sometime? Because Tracy doesn't buy cars she can't afford so that thugs break in our house. Tracy doesn't get kidnapped or destroy my yacht. Well, that's just because she's too busy getting fucked by dudes to get on TV. You don't talk about your sister that way. Well, I'm sorry, but it's true. I mean, according to her Life Invader page, she's hanging out with producers and porno guys this afternoon. What are you talking about? Actually, it's all happening right out there. What? That boat that makes yours look like a refugee raft? You know the kind of boat, the one that makes a young, impressionable girl drop her pants and spread her legs. This is the reason you brought me here, isn't it? You fuck. Ah! Dad, wait! Look, if you do go, Take me out of here. Dad, you're embarrassing me. These are my friends. Yeah, you're embarrassing her, dude. 
They're shooting porno here. They shoot porno all over town. Mom rented our house to them last summer. That was what? Your house? Yeah. Man, you got a killer pad, Mr. <laughs> Isn't it awesome? <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Those walls can talk. You think I do it? Hey. No. Hey. Shit, Ain't Daddy. cool, man. <laughs> what are you doing? Hey. Oh, oh, fuck, man. I like him. What's the problem? You're such a Ask jerk. Him. Come on. Dad, you dumbass. These guys are serious. Yeah, well, so am I. Who's to the seat of my fucking boat? Oh, motherfuckers. Get on, now. I'm about to skin you alive. God damn it. Go. Shit, they're coming after us. Go into that outlet. Now my... Oh my God, did you just kill him? Hey, don't worry. It's amazing what modern medicine can do. All right, all right. Take a deep breath, baby. It's okay. I'm taking you back to your brother. I'm an accessory to murder! No, you're not. You're an accessory to self-defense. Have I, like, got to be a witness because I... I, like, did some blow? You did blow? Yeah, I did some blow, and that might, like, make my testimony inadmissible. You're not admissing anything. There won't be a trial unless you're on a trial for doing blow. After you ruined my day, stole my friendship, capped them, and I'm the one on trial? You! You fucking asshole! Listen, he, he's the fucking asshole, okay? He smashed my TV and he took me to the beach. The beach with my skin. So what, you send him out to spoil my day too? I didn't know that he was gonna come get you. I just told him where you were. You know, he got that crazy look in his eyes, you know, like he gets sometimes and he just went. I'm getting a cab. Coming with you. How about I just drive us home? You ruined my life.
You got lucky, buddy. Fuck you, Lester. You gonna let me in or what? Give me a minute. I was wondering when you'd show up. I was dead. Praise be. Guess you weren't very dead. You need my help. How do you know? Because you came here. Why else would you? <clears throat> I haven't been a good friend for you, Lester. I know that. And you're gonna make it up to me by doing whatever I ask. Or rather, I, I mean... I need something done, you need to know something, so... Why not help each other? I gotta make some dough. So you're back in the game? I guess. Look, Lester, about what happened before. I know you never mentioned my name. I know I'm not on any lists anywhere. I know you never betrayed me. As for you, you gotta figure that I never told anyone. That instead of gently decomposing in North Yankton, you're angrily decomposing in Los Santos with a shrink and a wife who don't love you no more. Yeah. Yeah, well, <laughs> since you put it like that... Hey, shut up a minute. I'm getting an eye find alert. That little college boy sack of shit phony fuck. Who? Jay Norris? Yes. That fuck is a lying bastard. I've read his fucking emails. He's a fucking cheat. I heard him say that he saved America. What, by but... outsourcing all the jobs? By selling us little bits of plastic restricted access shit? Well, now it's payback time, you lying turd. What the hell are you talking about? You are about to get that white-collar gig that you always dreamed of, Mikey. Here, take this uh, fashionably retro weird for a 45-year-old man, but I cannot let go of the 1980s bag, and dress yourself up like a billionaire math genius with low-level Asperger's. You better be ready for the minor glitch of your repulsive pseudo-messianic life. Okay, Lester. Get out of here! Call me when you're ready. We are about to put the Darwinism back in social Darwinism. And brother, it is gonna be fun. You fucking kidding me? I'm a bank robber, not a web designer. So we'll go robbing soon. I'll find something. Just like the old days.
Ah, excuse me. I got this interview at this tech company. I'm thinking I need something, I don't know, geeky, youthful. Lost your job and the world's moved on, huh? That's too bad. I didn't lose my job. Of course. Got too old, got outsourced. Same thing happened to my dad. Now you gotta fit in with a different generation. Hmm? What about a vest and some cargo shorts? All right. Dignity aside, I think that might just work. Good luck at the interview. Goodbye. Michael? I'm all dressed up. Now, you want to run me through this thing? The prototype is somewhere in the Life Invader office. Find it and fit it with the device in your bag. They just gonna let me in? Why wouldn't they if you look the part? Hang around till someone opens the door and act entitled. Fine. Hey. Hey. Uh, oh, great. Uh, PM's pushing for more functionality. <laughs> but we are maxed. I mean, if anything, we have to strip features, especially if we plan on releasing a fully yeah. priced update a year later. Oh, my. You know, it's... Yeah, well, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do, you know? I mean, we're talking beta in Q4, maybe Q3. Look, milestones are one thing, but when design is changing its mind yeah. seemingly overnight, there's not much you can do about it. You Look, know what I'm saying? Uh, my union allocated smoke bricks bowed up, so... Wait a minute. Do I know you? Yeah, I think so. I, I, I T-temp, right? Yeah. You know, you gotta do something for me. Ah, uh, you gotta put it in a ticket. Uh, no. I'd like to keep this one out of the database, if you know what I mean. I'm totally becoming a tech evangelist when the big boys vest. Maybe not even tech. I'll evangelize anything. Hi. Oh, hi. Chill out on the beanbag. Marcus will be right out. Oh, um, I'm gonna take a normal chair. I have a terrible back. Here you go. If you guys let me use the OS I requested, this wouldn't... This is a filthy hard drive, bro. Uh, got any antivirus software? I think so. Behind this junk on the left. Clicked an NSFW link, bro. Bit me on the ass. Yeah, not safe for work, huh? You know, my son's computer runs into the same kind of problems. There you go. How about I run the antivirus software? Rocking out might get you in the right headspace. My son probably wrote this, a little shitbag. Wow. Your job is actually kind of stressful too, ain't it? Hmm. You want to take a break for some air guitar? Give me the wink, bro. Almost cracked it. And we scan. There it goes. Might be why I get all these migraines. Seriously, it, it might be why. And that should do it. Why don't you try and keep things strictly safe for work from now on? Hey, have you seen the prototype in the demo room? When Norris announces it at the keynote, minds are gonna blow. Yes, they are. That's 
Oh, nice. Making history, dude. Hey, and we couldn't do it without the little guys. Bye. Sit, 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 sit. Book bag, dig fast. Ow! Come on, you're gonna have to learn the foot bag if you want to get a job here, okay? Follow me. Okay. Some a-hole drank my effing head milk! There was a totally non-passive aggressive note on it! One year paid maternity leave program. Let me get the door for you. Lester, the thing's in the prototype. I'm going home to watch the keynote. Teabag time, my friend! Lester, did you hear me? Are you playing that game? Yeah, yeah, sorry, the phone is rigged. And hey, what's your problem, you don't like shooters? All the same. Besides, you know me. I'm a movie guy. Classic Vinewood. Classic Vinewood ended 30 years ago. Now it's just superheroes, romantic comedies, and remakes. None of which interest me. Hey. On fire. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Mr. Jay Norris to the stage. Hey, this company has come a long way since we started it in my parents' pool house in East Caraway. Today, you're about to witness a new phase full on weapons grade, red alert, world domination. We have put a billion people's private data in the public domain, and we have milked every penny we could in the process. And we have one of the youngest workforces in the world. An average age of only 14.4 years? That's not just impressive, it's revolutionary! Today, right here, we are about to make the next step. Prepare to witness the future. The Life Invader mobile device. Yes, we've invented something no one else has ever thought of. A small... Oh, hold on a second. I think someone's trying to talk with me. Hello? Oh! Uh, security! Oh, Jesus! Whoa! No, 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 no. Whoa! That was heavy. Are you watching the news? I don't have to. I'm watching the markets. I'll be trading pure alpha till close. All right. Hey, about that other thing. You know, the score. Oh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Let's do it. Put on a suit, look somewhat professional, and meet me at my warehouse off the LS freeway. Oh, uh, and I'm about to email you a link for the exchange. You can put in some trades of your own. I'm trying to stay off the day trading. Uh, but maybe I'll take a look.
Oh, wait! What's up, homie? Hey, look. Chop got to stay around your crib for a while, homie. That's cool? Yeah, man, it's cool. Shit's the best place for him anyway. Ha! <laughs> like it ain't nobody out there gunning for your black ass. Bullshit, nigga. Just take care of it, man, all right? All right, I got you, dawg. I don't want to know. Franklin! What the fuck? I mean, what the hell going on here? Wait a minute. Franklin, what are you doing here? I live here. This half my house, too. So you say? Anyway, Magenta is reinvigorating my femininity. So make yourself scarce, boy. Go. Go. With pleasure. Go. Goodness. And stay out of trouble! Yeah, yeah. Oh, Bitch, you ain't no more of a man than me. I hear that. Gangsta shit, nigga! Look who's been zapped. What's, up, What's happening with it, man? Oh, no, no. Show some respect here, nigga. That man, they couldn't hold down his back. Come on now. Damn, man. I got to spend my day with another middle-aged fool trying to recapture his youth. What this fool just say? I missed you, dawg. Oh, oh. You missed me, huh? Nah, no, I ain't missed you. Your ass could have stayed gone for good. So I fucked your girl, mm -hmm. mugged your moms, mm. and better yet, I ain't thought about your ass in years. Ha, ha. You got jokes now, huh? Hey, but I see you doing well for yourself. Check that on out. Shit, I'm doing just fine. That's what I hear. But I know some sweet boys up in the pen that got bigger balls than you. Oh, you been doing your time looking at sweet boy balls? Uh -huh. Yeah, it's good to have confirmation. This funny fuck. Why you keep hanging around this clown, L? Shake this fool, we man. We from the same set, Stretch. Why, why y'all niggas can't get along? Y'all been doing this shit for years, man. You know what, dawg? It's good you back home. Glad you here. Missed you, boy. Damn, you definitely got hit up inside. Hit up? Hey, hey. Yo, motherfucker, I know little niggas like you been turned out on the daily. Talking about being hit up, nigga, I swear, man. You ain't got no motherfucking respect. Motherfucker, I got respect for reality. Reality? All right. All right, you keep thinking that. Just keep thinking that, nigga. Shit, you gon' get yours. Fuck you. Uh, I swear, man. Sprizzettes, come whoa, on, whoa, man. Whoa, cool out. Fuck, Chill, man. man. This motherfucker get on my goddamn nerves. The nigga get on my nerves, too, man. Part of the nigga charm, man. F, come on, man. Let's just bust a move, man. You gon' drive or what, pimp? Drive where? Pick up this heat, nigga. Why? Business, nigga. Real business. Come on, bro. Y'all niggas act like girls. Shit. Not me. Shit. Ammunition. Come on. Let's go. Shit, homie, you gonna drop all that bread on that gear, you might as well get a haircut, too. Fucking crazy-haired microphone, motherfucker. I got a microphone I can shove right in your prison pocket. Nigga, you walk like you keister and shit anyway. You know, when I went away, you punks me. You punks was little homies, and I was a big homie. Now I'm out, and you little homies is big homies. But you still gotta respect. As soon as we get this shit, as soon as we get paid, homie. Ammunation, armorer to the stars. Hey, what's up, man? 
Firing range is in the back, and all our weapons are customizable. Oh, hell yeah! You can trick your blam blam out up in here. Quit all that. Just straight up artillery, man, all right? Don't y'all shut the fuck up. I got this, you clowns. All right, homie, get your shotgun with the flashlight modification. Why the fuck am I the only one buying this? Because we got sheets, homie. Now shut the fuck up and come on. <clears throat> now just let me reinstate, man, that the purchases made by this man ain't got nothing to do with the two gentlemen of fella nature. That's right. Yeah. Now let's go bust on some niggas. Man, we Shit. got some recycling to do. Come on, man. Send her off friends in La Puerta. You got some cans or some shit I don't know about? Nah, homie. We got ourselves a drug deal. Why do I get the feeling this gonna be one of them deals gone wrong type situations? Now, see, that's that negative attitude Lamar was telling me about, nigga. You ain't getting nowhere thinking like that. The power of positive bullshit. You ought to be clenching your motherfucking vagina muscles with my hunt, nigga. After his bid, it probably needs tightening up. This ain't new age shit. It's fact. You get what you get, fool. You been getting dick, but you ain't giving it, huh? Some Mark talk like that to an OG? <laughs> CGF has changed, man. No wonder the hood is so lame right now. Shit. Speaking of change, Lamar's been meaning to talk to you, homie. Nah, nah, not now, nah, homie. What's happening? It's nothing, my nigga, nothing, you know? Just some ideas, that's all. Man, ideas ain't your strong suit, so put it on me. It's nothing real, homie. When it's something real, we'll talk. All right, homie, we meeting in here. Man, how'd you find this place? The homie set it up. It's the kind of spot where we ain't gonna be disturbed. Oh, fuck, man. <laughs> <laughs> What's, What's up, up fool? What up, we it? got that shit, nigga, with a paper hat. Nigga, I'm talking about Buku Bill. Lamar boy. Davis. <laughs> What's up, boy? Everything cool? Hold on, man. What the fuck, man? You was just kidnapping this nigga. Oh, oh come, come on, nigga. You don't real F recognize real. D, my nigga, just got out crossing lines, did some time with some of your folks. Hey, look, look, look. This ain't about you, what? man. What? You know these niggas dumb. Yo, what fuck the fuck up? this trick talking about, man? Yeah, What's yeah, that? yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, somebody see, see? on us? They put a nigga on TV, man, about some gang intervention shit. Hey, this ain't the police, dog. This some ballers bullshit. Nigga, that's some bullshit. You. Hey, we was set up, nigga. This shit fuck, fuck up. you, nigga! Snake motherfucker! Oh, shit! Oh, bitch ass ballers! Come on, I through here! For a long time. Ah! Ah! Oh! Ah! Ah! That fucking D set us up! Fuck! I said lay low after you got clocked! You lay low, motherfucker, that ain't me! I can see that! Come on, little homies. Let's do this. Enough with all that shit. Fuck! Man, I deserve to get put. You going first next time, no fool? Shit, nigga, then we all be dead. Not me, nigga. Families ain't no more! Appreciate it, pimp. Lame ass ball of bitches. Did you think to work out an exit while you set up this meet? There's always a way out, motherfucker, and we gonna find it. Man, I don't want your clumsy ass falling down these stairs, fool. They was a safety ass before yeah, blood got spilled all over the place. We getting fucked in every direction. Roll a game. This is Watch fucked. Ass falling down. Send him back. Oh, don't get clapped. Time to move on. Oh, shit. Oh, Place on fire! Shit's burned! We gotta go, man! Move! You never fucking learn. Dumbass baby G! Man, back up! Hit the fuck up! Homie is down! Fuck you! Oh shit, I got more bullets! Shit! Keep your head down! Clowns, man! Man, clap! You fool! Ugly motherfucker! Trust my old motherfucking instincts. Lamar, what the fuck you get in the You don't know how to make money. This shit in a swan. I'm right behind you. Fuck! Cops outside. I ain't going back. Hey, one time! We ain't going nowhere with that top bonus. Take it out!
daddy drinking when he skeet you out. Man, where the roll is at? I wish I was in jail, not running with you, fool. Coordinated, motherfucker. I ain't catching this. side of the road. That's the story, dig? <laughs> That's it. That's it. We lost him. Now take us somewhere where we can get it in, homie. I'm driving back to my crib, man, all right? Hey, what the hell you bought me into back there? Shit, man, you the one popped his ass. I did the necessary. Yeah, thank you for that, dog. Here we are, man. You gonna hang with your auntie while the men break it off. Shut the fuck up. Hell no, nah, nigga. You sounding more and more like a snee eye itch every day. Hell no. Nah, yeah. Nigga, I sound like somebody trying to make some paper and not get killed. He's a hook ass nigga, I told nigga, you. Nigga, go toss a salad, stretch mark ass bitch. Fucking busted. Motherfucker. Hey, 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 whoa, back off there, cowboy. I know my constitutional rights. Anyway, I know you're coming here to suck cock, so it's all right. What the fuck you talking about? Well, hey, look, I saw quarterback blues, man. And, you know, some of those older records of yours, even they sound a little bit closeted, I'm just saying. What? A black man walking in vine wood, you think he clay PG sellout? You bitch-ass punk oh. motherfucker. Oh, shit, man. Oh, hey, I'm sorry, dude. I didn't, didn't have my, my contacts in, you know? I mean, I love black people. Yeah, you know, like, uh, like, I love gangsters. I love, like, gangster rap. Yo, sup! Man, who gives a fuck if he's gay or not, man? The man is not married. It's his business. 
Leave motherfuckers alone. Well, yeah, look, I'm, I'm just saying that, that it's uh, it's the hypocrisy that I can't stand. You know, I mean, of celebrities. Right? I mean, PG, right? He, he, he says he, he's a killer and a murderer and all that great stuff. And then, what, he, he loves his mother and likes show tunes. I mean, really, what kind of message is that send in our kids? You know what I'm saying? The guy's a fraud. Well, why do you care, man? Well, yeah, because, you know why? Because they all think they're gods, right? Well, fuck them. Fuck them! Fuck them! Fuck them! Fuck them! Fuck them! They're not magic! No, no, they're no better than me. They're no better than me. Shit! Oh shit! Oh my god, it's Miranda! Miranda, I love you, Miranda! Come on! Come on, it's fucking Miranda fucking Cowan! Because she's a fucking megastar! No, no, leave me out your shit, man. Oh no, 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 we, we can make Boku bucks here, man! We get one picture of, of, her, of her hairy legs or her aging muff, and we are in the money, man! In the money, bro! Come on! Come on, man! Come what on! What the fuck is wrong with me? Let's go! You drive, I'll get the shot! Go, go! Get us right up alongside that limo! You're a fucking mad! Look at you! I don't believe it! She's slamming a speedball in there, man! This is journalistic gold! Hey, here! Here, here, here! You bitch! Come on, come on, come on! You ruined Mark Bossenberg's wife's life! Man, they don't call her the silicone slattern for nothing. She looks like a bloodhound in a wind tunnel. God, I love her. Oh, man, no wonder this whole town's in therapy. You don't look a day over 45. <laughs> You're an angel. An angel? We done yet? No, she still looks too good. I want the prisoner of war shot. That's where the big zeros are. Busting up, Miranda! You bitch! Well done on the rehab! Not! Oh yes! We got side boob! We're historians, crusaders of truth, my friend! Man, we're two creepy ass stalkers on a motorcycle. Fuck you, Beverly! This one's mine! Oh no, no! It's that bottom feeder Madison! Shit! He's getting the money shots! Where's your dignity, man? Forget Miranda. We can't let him steal my exclusive. Get alongside him. I'll knock the weasel off. Stay on that bastard. You are a fucking lunatic. From me. You filthy petty sniffer. Cut out for this. Nearly. Are you this desperate, you sicko? Can you please Fuck show you some professional courtesy? Oh yeah, I downloaded your pictures to the fucking road, Madison! Now grow up and get a boy's name. Okay, buddy, let's get out of here. I'm already late for another stakeout. There's a small parking lot by the Cafe Redemption Courtyard in Morningwood. Drop me there, and you can keep the bike, because I look after my people. All right, homie, it's been an education, dawg. Look, keep on making the world a better place, you hear me? Yeah, the public needs to know. The fans deserve answers. Shit, not if the question is how low is Miranda Collins' muff hanging or if she getting banged out by some second-rate director? They need to know everything, from crow's feet to camel toes. Hey, 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 come by the manor next week. We'll continue the search for the truth. Look, don't wait around for me, homie. Oh, I'm waiting for you, homie. Yeah, who's this? It's Ricky from Life Invader. I know you're the bro who deactivated Jay, bro. <laughs> oh, I have no idea what you're talking about, pal. 
What you do is your business, bro. Anyway, Jay really got a big head once people started calling him a god. Guess you proved he wasn't one. They reintegrated my team in Burundi after the design got signed off. And now, my shares ain't worth dick. Sorry about that. I need work. I thought maybe you could provide. I mean, I'm smart enough to track you down, aren't I? I guess you are. Hey, I'll be in touch if anything comes up. Come in, Michael. Uh, yeah, thanks, Doc. How have you been? Oh, good. Things been good. No, actually, things ain't been good. Things been a far fucking way from good. I've been uh, acting out. That's what you would call it, I think, right? Acting out. So what exactly has been the problem? I'm not good, Doc. Not good at all. I'm sorry to hear that. Tell me. I just... I've been caught up in the bullshit, Doc. You know, ever since I pulled this Mexican's house off a hill, it's been nothing but killing and robbing. I mean, I hooked up with this old associate. I even got a new one, too, this kid. With, I don't know, he's got similar proclivities. You know? Oh, God. Now everything's out of control. I mean, but it's not by choice. You know, I just... My life just got away from me. That sounds a lot like denial, Michael. This is really worrying. So, any other violent urges, friend? Yeah. <clears throat> Even on the way over here, I think I killed someone. And you know what? I don't care. I'm sick, Doc. I'm a sick, hypocritical fuck. I agree. Which is why you should really bulk buy a batch of sessions. Buddy? I really just want to be happy, Doc. Is that so bad? Okay. And what about your sexual behaviors? I've been a really good boy, Doc. Really good. Not one problem. I'm glad to hear that. Really glad. Keep working it. This is great. I just ain't myself right now, Doc. Not since my life went crazy. 
You're plainly addicted to chaos. Well, I'm not sure that's true, Doc. <laughs> I'm not exactly enjoying myself here. You know, what I'm addicted to is not getting killed. But for some reason, I keep getting my ass into situations where getting killed is a little hard to avoid. What about the people you kill? Well, yeah, but that's not for fun. Are you sure? What exactly are you asking, Doc? Am I a psychopath who enjoys suffering? Or a sociopath who doesn't give a flying fuck about the rules? Come on, we've already had this conversation, right? I'm neither. I'm just a fat, washed-up jock who can't get his head around the fact that his high school football career didn't play out the way that he planned. The only way I'm content and, and competent is with a gun in my hand or a price on my head. You're very defensive, Michael. Do you consider yourself a failure? I pay you to listen to my problems. I mean, I'm rich, I'm miserable. I mean, half the time my kids can't stand me, the other half my wife is cheating on me. I kill people without remorse, Doc. Hell, I'm pretty average for this town, really. I, wait a minute, that's the shot. <laughs> I, I, I think I'm having a breakthrough here, Doc. Th this, I think, no, no, I know. I'm just terrified that I'm, I'm sure gonna... you are, but that's really all we have time for. <sighs> See you next time. Okay. <laughs>